and welcome and today I've got a bit of a special shirt because it's from a country where I've not actually had a shirt from and it's also a special shirt for a special player because this was his team Santos FC so we all know who I'm talking about and you must know I've got his name on the back to show you when I flip the shirt over Right then, let's go for a look around this one. Start that collar. I got this off FC24 shop. Brilliant. On this part. Down here. Excellent. As you do know, 24 FC24 shop. I can't fault them. So I'm I really am. I've got no worries with this shirt personally because it's like all the other shirts I've had. Oh, it'll be good. Up there, good. A little bit of a loose thread there, but they'll think they just, just chop it off. I'll leave it because I can't even, I really wouldn't notice that. Up to there, brilliant. Right then, let's go and have a look at these badges. And there's the Santos FC, and that's been embroidered and there's them two stars for something I don't actually know what they're for if somebody could tell me in the comments I would be grateful here we have the umbero and that's been heat pressed on it's a little bit a little bit sticky but never really seen one that's been stuck on before it's also something different and um, at the bottom of this one we have umbero official licensed product and that's been heat pressed on and on this side I can't read that. Compedo Mundial de Clubs 1962 to 22. I'm not exactly sure what that is. If somebody could tell me in the comments, I would be grateful. Right, and we'll go back to this pattern when I uh, do the uh, final thoughts at the end of the video. Right then, let's turn it over and have a look at the other side. Right, here we are on the other side. And obviously, you must know I've got on this side number 10, the great Pele. I just had to get Pele because this was his club. And uh, shame that he passed away at the beginning of the year. Um, so, and like I said, when I did all this shit, it was around the time when he actually did die. So, I've waited a few weeks for it to come. So, yeah, really good. And it just had to have the king. The God. I think he's the God of football. Nobody else better. Not even the great Maradona. He is the king. He is number one. Right, let's go for a look around the back of this one. Right, call it. Down this part. Excellent. Excellent. Down to the bottom. Excellent. Up to here, excellent. Now I'm to there, brilliant. Now let's go on about this uh, number, number ten. It's been heat pressed on, and it's done really well. And we get a Santos FC, Santos FC badge, and we get e football, that rubbish football game that is nowhere near FIFA, with little umbrellas, and then we get another umbrella up there, and that's been. That's a, bit, that's a bit sticky as well, but that's been done really well. Really, really well. Right, that's the back of the shirt done. Let's turn it inside out and see how good it is on there. Right, here we are on the inside. Right, start at the collar line. Excellent. And we have one little loose thread there just on this cutting off. Nothing major. Right. Let's go around. We have got a couple more threads there. Just need trimming off. Nothing major. I'll let it off. Going down there. Excellent. The bottom. Good. Here we have our mandatory washing instructions. Hand wash or Turn inside out, hand wash, 
I'll put on a very gentle cycle on the washing machine and you should, should last for years. Up this path. Good. Good. You have no loose sheds on this arm, which is brilliant. Right then, the talk of the badges. The umbro, you can see it to the materials, so it means it's a light material. And then with that being sewn on, we've got one and one on that star, and maybe one on that one, which is well, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Right, let's turn this over and see if it's as good on the other side. There we are on the other side. Start getting that collar line again. Oh, I like that. All them little umbro on the top. I like that. Go around. So there we have one loose thread there. Just chop it off again. Nothing major. Down to this bottom. Good. Up to there. Good. Up to there. Good. Round to there. Brilliant. And you see the difference on the material on this side. Look, it's got all aerated, so it's going to be a nice, breathable material. Right then, there we have that. Compact Mundial. The clubs. That's been heat pressed on. And then we have Umbro GB3XL. And here we have our umbro tags, which is has a little barcode on it and things. So yeah, looks legit. Shame it's not, but it looks legit. Right then, that's the inside of this shirt done. Let's flip it inside out again, and I'll do my final thoughts and wrap up this video. Right, we are back at the front. Right, let's go that material. And there it is again. Look, see that material. It's aerated but this material is silk which is really nice um right things about this shirt um on this we have a something written in the material look to what it says i don't actually know because i can't zoom in close enough to find out what it says um if somebody could tell me on the comments i'd be grateful um and it's just a nice looking uh, shirt i mean i was going to get the away of this one off FC24 shop um, but I just couldn't I couldn't do it I had to get this because of the great man passing away and I just had to get the home um, I mean it was, it was as soon as I knew that, that he was there he passed away it was just one shirt I had to purchase to wear just to wear and uh, it's, really, it's a really nice shirt, and like I say, it's another country where I've not got any shirts from. And it's really, really nice. I mean, that's different, the umbro being heat pressed on, and like I say, the collar, like that collar, the split in it, and it's, like I say, it's just a lovely looking shirt. And then, and then when you get the shirt, just turn it around a second, you just, you just got to get his name on it, haven't you? The great Pele, the man. The king, the god of football. Like I say, there'll be a never, there'll never be another Pele. Never mind Neymar's or <laughs> Messi's. Nah, he is the king. Long live Pele. Rest in peace, Pele. And uh, so I hope you've liked this one. Um, because like I, say, I got it for FC Twenty Four Shop. It took, like I say, with the Chinese. Um, holiday that they had it took a bit longer to come it took roughly it took about it took about 30 something days 32 days 35 i'm not exactly sure um but i ordered it when the holidays were on so i wasn't expecting to receive the shirt any time quicker so yeah and like i say so if you've liked this video drop me a like Drop me a comment, see what you what it says on this shirt. See if you can tell me what this says and what that means on the inside and on there. What the, what does that mean? What's that all about? Somebody could let me know. I'd be grateful. And uh, I might have some big news coming um, in future videos. I might be getting a sponsor to my videos. 
but I'll let you know in future. So like, subscribe, drop me a comment and I'll be back next week with another football shirt. Bye bye now. Rest in peace, Pelé.